Take a look at firearm registration numbers. In 2021, the number of firearm permits processed across the state decreased, but the number of actual firearms went up. And that's according to the state attorney general's office. The annual report just released said permits decreased by 10.8% last year, and nearly 23,300 personal and private firearm permit applications were processed. The permits issued covered a total of nearly 57,100 firearms. Just over half of the firearms registered were imported from out of state. The AG's office says the majority of new firearms being purchased are by current gun owners. Again, the, the people who pass these background checks are really you know, like 98% of them pass the, the checks too, are, are, are really law-abiding folks. These aren't the people, uh, these aren't the criminals out committing street crimes with guns. Now, this decline in permit applications happened before the U.S. Supreme Court struck down a New York law that required people to show a specific need to carry a firearm in public. That happened earlier this summer. In July, Honolulu Police Chief Joe Logan told the Honolulu Police Commission HPD has seen an increase in applications from the public to carry a firearm following that decision.